Hey everyone, and welcome to this week's episode of Five Minute Fridays. Brr. It's pretty cold it's out cold up here. It's a little cold. Not gonna lie. We got a bunch of snow this week. Yeah, nothing like cut and fall short. So, uh, what are we streaming with this week? This week, um, of course, we're streaming to YouTube and Facebook. We are. Uh, the, 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 sorry, <laughs> my, my tongue's frozen. We're using VMix Pro version 22, <laughs> waiting for 23 to come out. Um, I've got some PTZ Optics camera, USB, and NDI. Very nice. Using X Keys mouse mat. Yep. And also, the we're using VMix Social via Kindle Fire. Send us some comments. Yes, please. And as always, every week. Every week. The X Keys XKE 124 T bar with the video switcher key set. And I'm so happy to have you back at the helm this <laughs> week because, yeah, just him. I watched it a little bit last week, but then I had to, you know, board a plane or something. <laughs> yeah. You were in sunny California. Yes. What were you doing? I was at Adobe Max. It was a lot of fun. Was... Adobe Max. Yep. Max is the name of my friend's beagle. <laughs> well, he wasn't what's, there. <laughs> what's What's Adobe Max? Adobe Max is a conference all about Adobe products, so Photoshop, Illustrator, InDesign. Um, it's a really great conference. It's really inspiring. You came back with like a lot of creativity, inspiration, and also learned a lot and showed off our uh, Photoshop X, key, X keys for Photoshop keyboard. And yeah, we have a Photoshop keyboard. It is. We do. Oh, coming soon to the web near you. Okay. <laughs> um, and today. Today, Today, we have a mystery guest who's about to be revealed, uh, who tells us that he has come up with a magic method for controlling multiple PTZ cameras with our joystick, and they don't have to be NDI. We have an NDI app for that, but he has done something magical. I'm very intrigued by this. Me too. Uh, let's put our ears on and so bring him in. Here. All right. Maybe. Do I know how to put headphones in? All right, and give him some audio. There hey, we Tom. go, Tom. Hi guys, can you hear Hi. me? Okay. Yes, we can. We can. Welcome. <laughs> awesome. Well, I just want to let you know it's seventy-two degrees and sunny with a light breeze down here in Alabama. Uh, <sighs> just in case you were wondering. It's so. Just making us jealous up here. Rub it in. Yeah. <laughs> Just, and, well, you just got back from California, so that can't be that bad. It's true, but I came back to snow. Yeah, no. well, I tell you what, you know, when you were 12 years old, snow was the bomb, but not anymore. Tom, unlike our tech check, so, we've got a severe echo on you right now. It sounds like you're talking to us from the bottom of a well. But I tell you uh -oh. what, let's go. Oh, it's gone. It comes and it goes. Hmm. It's gone. So, uh, That's no good. tell tell us um, tell us about this magical PTZ procedure that you have come up with. Yep, apparently, and and this only works with VMix, so far as I can tell. Um, there is a shortcut in VMix called Move Input. And you say, okay, well, that's that's great. You know, how does that affect a PTZ camera? Well. Let me explain it to you very briefly, and then um, I will show you what we did. So, so ba basically, if you can imagine that input number one is going to be the PTZ camera. And so the, the, the X Keys XK68 joystick is going to be set to control whatever is input number one. The joystick will work, uh, the zoom in, zoom out will work with whatever is in input number one. And so in vMix, very simply, we just change which camera becomes input number one. Um, simple, right? We should have thought about this years ago. So let me pull up a desktop capture and um, take me a second here to juggle different PCs. But let me send you this and then switch over to that camera. And you can see I've got the uh, X, XK68 on the left, you can see my, uh, well, actually, you're not seeing a live view of that. Let's see, what do we need to do to make that live again? Well, that's no good. Hold on one second. Maybe I've sent you the wrong 
input. We, yeah, we got your mm -hmm. yep. guy. Got your capture button. Yeah. You can see that. Yeah, it's <laughs> not moving yet. Yeah, it's just not moving. That's okay. We're struggling with our overlays over here. Yeah, and... I don't know what's going on. It's, you know, it's Friday. There we go. There's the desktop. <laughs> oh, oh there goes in the left-hand left corner. People? Whoa. Holy cow. <laughs> Talk about a throwback. <laughs> yeah, this is a fallback Friday. So uh, let's let's get rid of that. This is, uh, this is, a, this is a live, live shot, shot right, right here. here. Um, the X keys. Not, not a very, very good, good shot because it's a, uh, a Logitech C920 zoomed in, which is a digital zoom. Um, but, but you can, you can see, see I've, I've got, got four, four keys set, set up here, here for black, black keys, keys, and those, and those allow, allow me to change whatever camera is going to be controlled by the joystick. And then I've got a row of green keys and a row of orange keys. Uh, I just picked out two colors they are not significant. Um, and, and the greens are camera number one, the oranges are camera number two. Position number one is the home button. So if I press that, that's just going to take me in the over-the-shoulder look. And position number one in the um, in the other camera, which is right over there. Did I freeze again? Uh, you froze, and we're getting that echo. It comes and goes. It's yeah, it's, it's sure. interesting. Not really sure why that is. <laughs> I don't really know what's going yeah, on with that. Well, it's gone now. <laughs> All right. Well, hold on a second. Let's see if we can fix that. That's okay. It's probably on my end. We're, we're trying a, a different setup today. And... Yeah, Tommy says he thinks you have too many mics, but I don't think that's the case. I think I we've know. got some kind of a funky loop in here someplace. But... Yep. Sit, sit tight. I'm, I'm going to be right back. Don't go anywhere. Okay. No problem. Okay. Welcome back here to us so we can entertain you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Show tunes. What do you want to sing? Uh, okay. There we go. It's not karaoke. Oh, now we're he back. says he's back. Okay. Now we're back. Yeah, this is uh, a little funky, but let's see if it'll work. How's, how's the audio here? Um, we... There you go. You're in sync. Okay. But it appears that there's more than one of me. Uh, Sounds like you have a deep, keep, almost echo. <laughs> yeah, it does sound like you're talking from a cave, but we can understand you, so. Okay. Let's try that. Is that better? Uh, no. Not that. There you yeah, go. Yeah, that's better. That's it. Okay. I was sending you three microphones. What the oh, heck? Hey. Well, you know... If, if one is good, two is better, and three is best. <laughs> Three's a crowd. Yes. Just really wanted to hear it. Hear you. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. So let's uh, let's go back to this shot right here. Um, basically, I, these are, are shortcuts in vMix that go to preset camera input. So they really don't have anything to do with the joystick. You can do this on any X keys. Okay. Um, I can I can get it to pan. I can go back to the home position. I just have the three shots set in there. Uh, so we'll go back to that guy. Um, I've got a zoom in and zoom out button. And again, these are specific to whichever camera I want. So I'm going to shift over to camera one here. And now I can zoom in and zoom out on camera one. And I can use the joystick to control camera one. Uh huh. And nice. it is very uh, pressure sensitive. So if I, if I move it just a little, it's going to move just a little. And if I move it a lot, it's going to, it's going to move a lot. Now, this is my studio, so don't pay any attention to all of that stuff back there. <laughs> you see Dan, the banana guy there, and then an extra shirt. No, you're not supposed to see that. This Sorry is your cousin, that. Dan Sinclair, okay. I understand. That's right. That's right. Uh, so, so we're going to switch back to controlling camera number two. And now with camera number two, now, this, this webcam only has the X and Y axis. It doesn't have that, that, um, that angled access. Ah, you know, right. It, um, you know, top to right. Be, to pan and tilt right. at the same uh, time, yeah. Gotcha. Right, right. So it, it's only going to go left, right, up, and down. But that's a limitation of the camera, not yep. of the X keys, because if we switch over to controlling camera number one, now we can do a nice, soft, diagonal pan. 
Uh huh. Very go. easily. Um, <clears throat> so, it's uh, and this is not NDI. These are not. I mean, obviously, if I'm controlling a Logitech C920, uh, yeah. that's not NDI at all. So you can control. Actually, you can control any camera as if it were a PTZ using this controller and this method. Um, I think I even have a take button. Yeah, there you go. Um, didn't have a chance to get this guy set up and fully populated. I had lots of things I was going to do with it, but you know, that's the way it goes. So we've got <laughs> out focus. You don't want to see my head. Uh, um, and there's my trusty uh, XK80 uh, from NAB two years ago. Thank you very much, Dan. Um, <laughs> so uh, I'm going to let you take a look at the shortcuts that I've set up. And so in vMix, I'm going to go into settings. And then I'm going to go into shortcuts and pay no attention to these shortcuts. These are all the shortcuts that I use on my regular show. But starting, let's see, starting about here. Um, and let me let me do something else before we do that. Let me turn on the sharpen so that you guys can see this a little more easily. That should clean it up just a tad. All right, so we're going to go back to shortcuts. Uh, we'll go to settings, we'll go to shortcuts, and I'm going to scroll down to all the settings that start with MIDI note on two, because that's that's my PTZ Optics, yep. oh, excuse me, my X Your <laughs> XK68 joystick. Yep. And, and so here are my two move inputs. Um, when I press button number one, which we can find button number one, is two seven. When I press button number one, it does a move input and it takes camera number one, you see all those ones that makes it easy for me to spot when I'm glancing down there. Uh, camera number one, which is currently in input number two, camera number one is currently input number two, and it moves it to input number one. So let's take a look there. And here is the value right there, the one, that's where I want it to go. So where, wherever camera one is, doesn't matter what input, could be input number 17 and it's going to move to input number one. So we'll close that out. Here's camera number one down here. Mm -hmm. yeah. And as I mash the, the, the one button, which is camera number one, it's going to take that guy and move him over there. Boom. There, there he is. Okay. Now I'm in oh. control of camera number one. <laughs> and you can do this with as many cameras as your PC will support. Um, the X keys doesn't care. You could control 30 cameras with this guy if you wanted to. You could. There's Very no, cool. I mean, the only limit's really going to be your PC limit and your operator's ability to <laughs> handle all those cameras. <laughs> right. Um, that is a very slick now, trick. Now, there are probably more enhancements that we can do with this. We just haven't gotten that deep into it yet as, right. as to uh, the ability to, to set presets here on the keyboard. I think we can do that. Um, I just I just haven't played with it that that much more to do that. But I also have presets that I have preset in vMix. These are not presets that I've used by by method on the keyboard. Right. The presets that I've used in vMix, and these will work regardless of what the camera button is down here. So if yeah. we're on camera number two and I want to do a camera one preset, we we can do that. Okay. Cool. Those are independent of what you're trying to control at the moment. Nice. Starting right here and moving down to right there, all of those are the shortcuts that move the PTZ. Okay. Oh, actually, these last two don't count. All of these <laughs> that, are, that start with PTZ zoom, PTZ move, um, those are ones that control the PC. And you see they're assigned to input number one. Number one, right. So whatever camera is is currently input number one these will work on very cool yep. that is cool very it, it it's you know it's it's the power of vmix and the power of the x keys put together it's a wonderful combination yep yep so um Come back to that's this. really it you know it's it's not anything fancy um I, it's but it's a great it's uh, awesome though 
Now, I know um, you're going to have some questions, but before we get to those guys, since I'm here, I get to ask mine first. Uh (laughs) I do recall that in vMix settings, they allow you to set the speed for your PTZ in, in, in fine increments. So you could make it, you know, really slow, really fast, depending on your move. Is that done at the, at the camera input level or so would, would you be able to set those speeds for each individual camera or would they be universal well, for your input one? Dan, that's a great question. Great question. <laughs> so let's take the, the joystick movement PTZ move up and we're going to just take a look at that one for a second. So I'm going to double click it and we can see that vMix has the ability to use pressure enabled as a way to control that. So oh. we don't have to put in any of the inp- uh, any of the speed numbers. vMix just knows because vMix loves X keys. <laughs> vMix just knows that it can the that the further you move that joystick, the more you press on that joystick, the faster you're going. The faster you go. That's right. Yep. Okay. Let's see, I'm not sure which camera I'm set for right now. There. You go. Oh man, I now I'm going to have to get the joystick out and start messing with that. <laughs> Time to start playing. Isn't that cool? That, that is, is really cool. cool. I mean, that is just Thanks. the coolest thing. All right, now and before I'll tell we you. go ahead. <laughs> yes, go ahead. So before we completely blow our five minute Friday reputation, because we're at 26 <laughs> minutes right now, um, we're, we're going to close our, our this segment and then we're going to come back uh, and take a Q&A in the post show. OK. You're going to be with us, Tom. I'm sure. OK. <laughs> I, I can be there. We will be <clears throat> right back. Yep. All right. You still with us? I'm still with you. Awesome. All I see is me, though. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that's what I put up. But that's okay. we just wanted to give everybody, you know, a little, a little extra Tom, <laughs> Tom time. Tom time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> okay, so uh, what do we have here? We have a lot of comments. Do we have any questions? Let's look for questions first. Mm. <laughs> this is one that we all know the answer to, Tommy. I use DDCam. <laughs> I'm your streamer, caller. <laughs> Come to the dark side. Richie Ignacio's trying to get me to the dark <laughs> side. Uh, let's see. Tom Vader talking, yes. And greetings right, from Michael. Denmark. Yeah, Thanks Michael, for please. Joining. Thanks for joining us, Michael. Good to hear from you. Absolutely. We have greetings to other people. Uh, here's a big question. Can you see that, Tom? Tom, are you sure you aren't a oh, lizard? Yeah. Well, <laughs> you know, it, I got I, I have to confess, I'm a geek. <laughs> this is what I think about when I'm not working. Um, in the shower, you know, saying like, <laughs> Tom, get out of the shower. You've been in there for an hour. Like, no, I can't. I'm I'm in a zone. I, 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 <laughs> it's all coming to me now. But uh, you know, you ought to see my water bill. It's, it's horrendous. But that's that's the price of success, I guess. It's a lot Speaking of water. of water, Rich says it's Tom Shark. Do 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 do. Oh my goodness! Is, isn't that so cool that you, that is you can really take cool. just this one little 
this this one little function in vmix called move input and it just opens right. up the whole keyboard yeah that's okay. amazing that's awesome. tremendous. because we get that question so all the time let me tell time. you the backstory on this okay i had a client who said yeah you know we want to get some we want to get some ptz cameras and we want you to build us some 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 pcs and um and then they said and they and they said you know we'll just use vmix uh, uh pro and we can control the ptz cameras with that and i said okay you know we can do that i said you know we there are other ways to control the ptz cameras and they said you know what you're right we want the x keys xk68 joystick and i went <laughs> you know and i'm thinking to myself the only way that 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 controls it is if you've got the NDI app that goes along with it. And last time I heard, which of course I'm not I'm up, not up to date, but the, the NDI app was still kind of in beta. Um, and and I said, you know, I got a client. He wants this X Keys product. There's got to be a way for me to make this work. It's got to it's got to work. Right. And I sweated blood on that for about a week, and then all of a sudden it hit me. You know what? I think vMix has got a shortcut that allows me to reposition an input in a different location. If I could do that, then all I have to do is set up that home location as the control for the X keys. And I, I tore out of the shower, got a towel <laughs> on, headed up here to the studio in just my towel. And uh, that was a sight, let me tell you. And, and in about five minutes, worked it all out. It was it was absolutely amazing. It was so, so cool. fun. It was so much fun. And I wish you guys had been here. It would have been great. I don't think I want to see you I with mean... a towel down. It's just <laughs> well, other than the towel. <laughs> <laughs> Rich other says than the shower part. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Rich says he can envision a team of PTZ and XKeys operators. Yes, absolutely. And Michael. Quest says X key 68 with shuttle for replay. Can it be reconfigured for PTZ also? Yes, Michael, you could do the same thing Tom just did, and you could use keys for your PTZ commands for driving it around. Um, could you use the wheel? Uh, maybe. Sure. That'd be an interesting test. Yeah, I, I bet you could. It'd be an interesting thing to try. Yeah. Good question. So really good coming. question. Maggie, this is great work. Yes. Well, I was in the shower again yesterday. <laughs> uh oh. Actually, I'm in the shower a lot, but I was in the shower <laughs> yesterday, and I realized how to use the new VMix SRT and the the X keys replay simultaneously. Oh. So you take a, a regular production uh, that has cameras and announcers and vMix and all that stuff, and you do an SRT output from that back to a studio where somebody that's not even there at the venue can control the instant replay using the X keys uh, instant wow. replay controller and then send that back to that on venue location to be mixed in using the vmix srt so vmix vmix loves x keys you know? they <laughs> just, just yes so and it's cool things that it's mutual i mean yeah definitely mutual x keys <laughs> loves vmix yeah. uh, uh we've ruined martin steed's friday with the image of you and your towel sorry uh, <laughs> um and and michael says yeah that is his question is about the wheel and yeah we'll have to be messing do, with that do some i'm not testing. i wonder if that pressure setting could work with our jog wheel as it's being rotated through its huh we'll just have to experiment or you just set the jog wheel in the first you know four or five increments right and left to mm -hmm. be the the dip the four or five i guess there might be four or five different speeds however many speeds the camera can have yeah. right uh, the jog wheel could be used to control that um yeah oh geez <laughs> tommy's already asking he's, yeah you did something great for us today but what about tomorrow He's so demanding down there. <laughs> I'm, Always I've got something things. for tomorrow, Tommy. Don't worry. We got you covered. <laughs> uh, yeah. And Michael says he too gets his best solutions while he's in the bath. <laughs> Don't we all? Hey, it's go. a great time to think. 
It is. It, 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 it's just something, you know, maybe the, maybe the steam kind of makes your brain work better or something. <laughs> Sorry. I've got to... Oh, my gosh. Oh, you're missing limbs. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about that. So, guys, that's it. You know, it was, it was a pretty simple, simple solution. It just took a while to, to it, come up with it. Yeah. But um, we're going to be oh, selling and... a ton of XK68 joysticks as a result. And we do have this key kit, uh, which is from our NDI PTZ design. But I think, Tom, we should be talking to you and looking at what keys work best with your solution because they may not be the same. Yeah. Um, but if if they are, awesome. If not, then maybe we need to make another key set. Okay. Well, I would love to have a conversation with you guys about what what those keys mean. Yep. <laughs> I looked at them and I was like, hmm, I don't know what that means. <laughs> She's I'm from she's, Alabama. I'm not real smart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Those are northern keys. Oh, <laughs> that's right. Miranda's the key master here. She's the True. one to talk about to about keys and and come up with those sets. Right. Yeah, no, we can. Well, let's let's we can get together. together. Uh, Mr. Willis says he only gets his ideas on Saturday night down at the creek. I it may have something to do with his still. I'm not <laughs> not sure about that. I'm not sure what that refers to. Okay. All right. I have something went over my head there. <laughs> but oh, no, that's fun. I that's still so cool that you can that you figured that out to, it really, to I, do it, that. And isn't it amazing that when you come up with a solution like that, it seems so simple? Like why didn't you see it in the first in place? Respect. Yep. Oh, well, and we're going to be doing a Black Friday deal, uh, packaging together the X Keys XK68 with your key kit um, and VMix Pro. So if ah. anybody's interested in that, we'll be putting together a Black Friday deal on nice. those. Great idea. Yep. Uh, what was this question? Can I expand my XK68 with more keys too? You can if you get another X Keys. <laughs> Yes, you can put another X keys right next to it, and uh, and VMix will support all of them. Yep. I should probably read these before I put them up. You know, <laughs> an, an interesting thing about this guy is that in VMix, this guy has to be implemented twice. Once for the keys, and once for the joystick. Oh, really? Oh. It took me a little while to, to understand that. Do you have to have them on separate like MIDI point, channels? No, or, the no, same just channel. have to, same channel. Just have to enable them, both of them. Same okay. channel, right? Okay. And it's, and it's two different sets of positions, obviously, because this used to be an X, XK80, um, and so whatever the the commands are for the joystick portion, those commands are in one particular part of VMix, and then all the buttons are in another part, and they both have to go on the same MIDI channel. Okay. Okay. Yep. That'll be Fair part of the way. demo that I put, I mean, part of the tutorial that I put together. I'll send you um, a link to it. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Please this do. This should be done by Easter. <laughs> yeah, you know. <laughs> I understand completely. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. <laughs> so I don't know, do you know what the theoretical limit is on how many different X keys you can have connected to one PC? There is a uh, a USB limit on how many USB devices you can connect to a PC. I think it's established by the operating system, and I think it's. I don't remember off the top of my head. It's like it's one of those multiples of sixty four. I think it's like two hundred fifty four yeah. or something like that. Two fifty six. Yeah. Something like that. <laughs> wow. Something like that. Uh, yes, we we could get the Guinness Book, Book of World Records on the most <laughs> X keys connected it. to a single PC. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Be awesome. uh, I think uh, VMix. You, oh, what do you? How many MIDI channels does he support? Twelve, I think. I'll check. Maybe sixteen. Maybe sixteen. <laughs> <laughs> well, that well, but it wouldn't have to necessarily all be VMix, right? 
But True. yeah. I guess. <laughs> This is the correct answer that Rich has, as much as my credit card can handle for the limit of X keys. That's true. <laughs> and and Rich, we think that is a yeah, fine yeah, right. policy to follow, yeah, that you should try to max out your credit card <laughs> buying X keys. <laughs> That's right. I'm not a financial advisor. Don't know. <laughs> He's definitely not a financial advisor. <laughs> Well, uh, does anybody have else any have more any questions, questions? Anybody? It's been fun. It's been this has been one of our more informative shows, I believe, yes. with uh, your tutorial there, Tom. Thank you, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guys. Poor guys. <laughs> <Jesus. laughs> we. Uh, uh, you, yeah, you know, Tom, that I'm leaving PI at the end of the year. It's not a secret. Um, but uh, uh, our president here, Michael Hetherington, has generously agreed to host a farewell bash for me tonight at our local brewery, at the Old Nation Brewery in Williamston. Yep. Uh, Tom, if you leave now. You might be able to make it. I think you might be able to make it. <laughs> how, how fast can you drive? Just hold one for me. Okay. <laughs> I tell you what, I'll, I'll get the second round. There All right. Go. All right. There you go. Perfect. So yeah, looking forward to that. Tab. We'll have a lot of friends stopping by. Should and be a good time. These guys will be there with me, so I know it's going to be a good time. Of course. So. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Well, that's an unfortunate circumstance, I think. Doggone it. But that's the way life works sometimes. But you and I probably need to talk about post-PI. There you go. Oh, yeah. If you don't already have some thoughts. In, in between reason that granddaughter, I'll have some time <laughs> to do a few things. And um, I'm moving to Grand Rapids, which is where our buddy, Mr. Davidson, is from. So I'm hoping to to do some projects with him Very and, cool. uh, and pick up a few other things. Yeah. Nick's a good guy. Yep. Yeah. That'll be fun. I miss these guys, but, you know. Well, of course we're going to miss you. <laughs> Come on. All right, before I start crying, we'll say goodbye. <laughs> Thanks, right. Tom. Thanks yes, for thank coming Thank you on. for joining us today. Tommy, Rich, Maggie, uh, Steedy, Rudy, uh, love all you guys. Thanks for, for showing up in the chat. Uh, this isn't yeah. my last show. I will be oh, back no. to annoy you a few more times for the end of the year. <laughs> but uh, I... Just grateful for all you guys coming on and and uh, hanging with us and and making this fun. Yeah, because it is fun. All right. Okay. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. See you next time. Thank you. Go blue. Go green. <laughs> nope. Go blue. Go green. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>